All right, so for this one, we're gonna do pastels. So pastels, we did oil pastels. Um, these are kind of like, this is chalk pastels. Basically, it's somewhat similar to what we um, use on the sidewalk. Um, so they're soft and they can get real messy. So just be aware it might get a little bit messy, but it'd be fine. So on our paper, we're gonna do what we always do. We're gonna make a two-inch grid. Two, four, six, eight, ten. I'm gonna go twelve. If you draw it lighter, the better it will be. So um, you can erase a lot easier. So we did two, four, six, eight, ten. The edge of my ruler is twelve. What we've done before. We're drawing a really light. Alright, so for this on my paper, I'm using um, this is a cream or a tan, really like tan paper. If you don't have that, that's fine. We can figure another way. Just use regular white paper. So I did my horizontal lines, I'm gonna do vertical, lay my ruler her horizontal, did the same numbers two, four, six, eight, and then ten. The edge of my ruler is 12. You do 2, 4, 6, 8, 12. Do the same thing. I'm using my pencil to connect my little dashes, my markings. I'm not applying a lot of pressure. So I just left this area on the bottom done. We don't need that as far as um, our drawing is concerned. So we got, we have our printout. Like always, it's important that we have this. Um, for you to learn to look at the colors yourself. Don't always copy me. What I'm gonna do is cut this little piece off at the bottom. So the same thing as we always do, you know, I'm gonna label A, B, C, D, E on the top one. Skip that one, one, two, three. Get ahead of myself. One, two, three, four, five. And then I'm gonna transfer my drawing like always. When so an A, there's nothing in that whole column, so I'll just leave it blank and go to B. It's about halfway, so I'm going to go about halfway in my square that I'm using. A little bit more halfway on the left side. Shadow. Alright. So 
I got my drawing, got that part done. Just run, run through that. So this is a scrap piece of paper. If you don't have this paper, just use whatever you have. All right, so I'm just gonna start messing. Now, like I said, chalk pastels can get really messy really fast. You'll have this dust, so just kinda be patient. Um, so what I'm doing now is just trying to figure out what colors to use, how to blend, because you can put color on top of colors. finger and blend it really smooth. Or if you like it um chunky that's fine too. So you can do either one that you like. You feel like it really smooth and blended. Or do you like this chunky type look? Well not really chunky but more um using it a lot. Alright so just play around with it and this um for a couple minutes as long as you need trying to figure out what to do how to use stuff and then we'll be back and start <laughs> 